When you present the cash discount program and they're just not into it, but they're friendly and willing to talk to you, let's talk about what the worst case scenario is here and always make sure that you're not leaving any options on the table. Let's dive into this lesson. great thing about this business is there is not a single customer that you cannot help. So never leave without presenting all the options that you have. If a business isn't comfortable with the cash discount program, come up with other ways to help them out. You do that by asking if you can do a written proposal for them. So on the cash discount program, you don't really need to do a proposal. If they tell you they're paying $500, you can just quote their savings because you know what it's going to be exactly. If they don't want to go that route, then ask them if you can do a statement analysis. It's very simple. They give you one of their statements, one of their bills from their current processor. You tell them you're going to see what kind of fees you can get rid of, and you're going to put it in writing. Not only are you going to see how much you can save them, you're going to give them three different options. You're going to show them the savings in the form of the cash discount program. You're going to show them the savings in the form of the hybrid program, which are still like 40 to 60%. And then you're going to show them the savings on traditional pricing. They're going to have three options, all of them in writing and all of them itemizing which fees you're able to get rid of or lower. You already worked really hard to find someone who is willing to talk with you and is willing to save money. So don't ever leave the business just because they aren't willing to do the cash discount program specifically. Utilize that relationship that it took you a lot of time to go out and find and develop and at least do a statement analysis for them and give them their options. Your statement analysis, at least with us, should take 20 to 30 minutes for you to get back. And it's going to give you a chance to go back in person rather than just leaving and then that's it. You're going to actually come back and meet with that business owner with something in hand that's going to really give them a clear visual on how much you're talking about saving them on the cash discount program. They should already grasp that, but it's going to show them one last time in writing. But ultimately, it's going to give them additional ways to do business with you as well. We're all in this to make residual income. Cash discount program, the profits are significantly higher in terms of residuals and in the savings for the merchant, but all other programs still create residual income and savings for that merchant. They're gonna get a better experience with us. They're gonna love the service that they get from you as the rep. They're gonna love the service they get from us as a company with the customer service and technical support if they ever need it. So let's make sure that at the end of the day, we remember what our mission is and it is to help the small business owners out there, not only to save money, but to work with a great company that is actually going to take care of them. That is not normal in the industry. At the end of the day, that's what this is about. So if they aren't willing to do the cash discount program and save the most amount possible, let's still help them out any way, big or small, and make sure that they get with the company so that they can have a good experience for the first time ever in this industry.